what's going on guys Brian or creations here and today you guys are going to be watching some Call of Duty Advanced Warfare gameplay nonetheless so hopefully you do sit back relax and enjoy it the greatest Call of Duty ever made uh, yeah right anyways uh, I'll also be splitting up the gameplay with Destiny so hopefully you guys don't mind I'm sure you will click off once it turns into Destiny gameplay that's a perfectly okay but I hope you stay if you do enjoy the commentary. Anyways, dropping right into it. So, I want to talk to you guys uh, about a couple things today. My one question is going to be, what's your favorite or your most anticipated game of 2015, not 2016? Uh, the remainder of this year, the last quarter of games that are going to be coming out. It's absolutely disgusting. I'll name off the list in a little bit here. But I kind of wanted to talk to you guys about taking breaks on YouTube and if they're necessary or not. So a lot of people, I know um, some guys were a little bit frustrated that I wasn't uploading for a week, two weeks at a time. Um, which is not like me because I used to upload it every day on my old channel. And then when this channel came out, I upload five days a week and then th three days a week very consistently. I would say for the first six months of this channel's life. And then the past month, month and a half, it's just been very sketchy. I've been uploading once a week, max, uh, which is just awful. And I want to apologize for that. Again, I've told you guys countless times of why, so I'm not going to get into that. We're just going to hop into our commentary topic. Uh, but I do want to say that I think breaks are necessary on YouTube sometimes, depending on who you are and all the things you've kind of talked about when you're like me and I've been doing YouTube since I would say October 2011. I had a clan channel that I ran and then a personal channel, then another personal channel, then my previous channel, uh, which was given to me by Ted and now this channel. So I've ran, I think five YouTube channels in total in the past, what will be in this October, four years. So I've been doing YouTube for quite a while, uh, unsuccessfully for the most part, except for my last channel and this channel. And uh, breaks are needed sometimes, honestly, like, after you've been doing YouTube for four years like I have, you kind of run out of commentary topics. Of course, there's constantly new things going on in the game gaming community, but some of the time, it's just... It's topics that have been spammed so much that people don't even really want to hear it anymore. Uh, I felt like talking about Gamescom in my last video on Monday because I think that's something people are genuinely interested in, and I didn't see too many people talking about it, so I figured I'd, I'd cover it, and I mean, I'm looking forward to Black Ops 3, I still, I'm not going to say it's going to be the best COD ever, Black Ops 2 wasn't really my favorite COD, Black Ops 1 was my all-time favorite, so the Black Ops series has kind of been hit or miss for me, and we're going to see how Black Ops 3 turns out. I know I'm certain the zombies are going to be great. I'm sure the campaign's going to be pretty solid. Call of Duty campaigns are always pretty decent anyways. And uh, that kind of gives me to my next commentary topic is what is your guys' most anticipated game for 2015? Uh, we have Fallout 4, which by the way, I am a Fallout virgin. I've never played a Fallout game, but I will be picking up Fallout 4. Not quite sure if I'll be getting it for the Xbox or PlayStation. I don't know what's going to have exclusives for. Uh, first, I'll probably get, you know, whatever console, uh, the game for whatever console that has exclusives first. Uh, so there's Fallout 4, and then we have Destiny Taken King, which is basically Destiny 1.5. That's the PlayStation 4 console I'll be getting, that bundle edition, Taken King, whatever, uh, that white PS4. So I'm looking forward to getting that. Uh, and then, of course, we have Black Ops 3. We have Gears of War being remade, Gears of War 1 in August, which I'm actually looking forward to. Uh, I was a huge fan of the Gears of War series. Uh, funnily enough, though, Gears of War 1 was my, my least favorite. I loved Gears of War 2 and 3. Great games. I think Gears of War 1 was phenomenal. The storyline was great. The multiplayer, I didn't get to play in its prime because, I mean, it came out in 2006. Uh, it's a nine-year-old game. It's it's pretty old when I actually think about it. It's crazy it's been that long. I remember going over to my friend's house and playing that game, and I just can't believe it's that old. Anyways, I am mumbling on. Uh, so Gears of War, I'm looking forward to that in August. I'll be picking that up. I recently picked up Far Cry 4, which I think came out last year. I don't know if it came out in 2015. Uh, but I absolutely love that game. I beat it in like three days, and I've been playing the shit out of it. It is so much fun. Far Cry 3 was actually 
Uh, one of my favorite multiplayer first-person shooter games I've ever played. And I know that's such a weird thing to say. Yes, Far Cry is multiplayer and Far Cry 3 is multiplayer. My opinion was amazing. It was everything I wanted Call of Duty to be. Uh, but getting back on track, we have Halo 5 and Rainbow Six Siege. Those are the other two games coming out this year. And... I don't, I don't know, man. I, I'd say my most anticipated game of 2015 is not in 2015, it's in 2016, and that's The Division. You guys know on my old channel, I covered a video on it back in 2014, I think back, no, actually May 2013, a long time ago. Uh, I can't believe it's over two years now, I've been waiting for that game to come out. It'll be two and a half years when it finally drops, or almost three uh, so the division, I know it's cheating because it comes out in 2016, but I'm looking forward to that game the most. I cannot wait to get my hands on it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to smack that like button. I would appreciate it so much, and I will see you guys in my next one. Peace out, guys.